New York City Council member Jumani Williams also spoke. Williams was arrested, along with fellow city council member Adonis Rodriguez and 16 others, as they and others attempted to block an ambulance being used to transport Ravi Ragbir to detention last week. I want to say to those who question myself and council member Yad Yadonis Rodriguez and the others that were arrested with us, who question why uh, we were in the streets, who question why we were blocking a van with people in it. If you come out of a building with no lights and no sirens, you are a van with passengers. <laughs> if, if you are questioning what we were doing there on Martin Luther King Day, please shut your mouth. <laughs> Don't let that man's name come out of your lips if you dare question why we were in those streets. We are in the streets because we follow the best tradition of the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King and so many like him. There are people who want to sanitize who Dr. King was, who want to sanitize his message. But let us be clear, he was an agitator. He was a disruptor. He wanted to disrupt the norm. Do not confuse nonviolence, which I agree with, with being docile. We are going to disrupt and shut down whatever we need to do until we make people understand we are fighting to uproot the same system that Dr. King was. And I say uproot because I always want to make it clear that the system is working how it was designed to work. The people who are on the bottom were supposed to be there. We don't need to change the system. We need to uproot it and replace it. We in this room are in the best tradition of this country. I get upset when I hear people saying what's happening now is not what America is. Donald Trump and his cronies are not who America are. America was founded on those values. We need to be clear about that. That is the tradition of America. But I thank the Lord that I serve that there are people in this room who have pushed back from the beginning of this country, and we are the ones who were in the street fighting for Ravi Ragbear. We are the ones who were in the street fighting for Gene. We are the ones who are fighting for the people who are called other in any country. I stand here proud because in that street with those folks, was a proud, proud day. It was the closest that I felt uh, to what must have happened when people were fighting decades ago. Uh, nobody here was there. Nobody can say that they, they are those people that we celebrate. But the feeling of fear that I had and understanding that the morality of what was going on dictated that I continue to move forward within that fear. So I'm here to tell folks some people say, don't be afraid, don't be fearful. Fear is not a spirit of God. But I'm here to tell you, while that is true, I am human and so are you. So fear is a human emotion. But what we need is the courage that God has given us to move forward in that fear. And I feel the courage in this room to make sure we move forward, to make sure we get justice. New York City Councilman Jumani Williams, among 18 people arrested after Ravi Ragbir was attained. Uh, Jumani Williams has also announced his intentions to explore the possibility of running for lieutenant governor here in New York. When we come back, we'll be joined by the relatives of both Jean Montreville and Ravi Ragbir. And we'll speak with Jean Montreville, who has just arrived in Haiti after he was deported. Stay with us.